With the advent of the World Wide Web, uh, universities needed a way for faculty, staff, students, alumni to find things. And so the hot idea of the late 90s and early 2000s was a portal. So we created One Start, just like many universities did, and it was supposed to be the way to find services. But over time it got a little junked up, just like a closet, as everybody moved in. And by the time we hit 2010, 2013, we knew we had a problem. We were also seeing concerns from students saying they're having trouble finding things. And I knew after a dozen years of our portal, we needed a new approach. We want you to be able to come to this environment, search for what you're looking to do, find it, interact with it, and be able to walk away satisfied. And they came with an idea of saying, let's make a portal that is search, click, done. And I said, can you do that? And they said, yes, we're gonna make an app store. All these small things that people need to do, pay a parking ticket, find concert tickets, look up my grade, change my HR benefits, we'll make them like apps. And we'll have a IU app store and people will be able to search, find an app, click to the thing they need to do, and we'll push authentication to one of the latest things they do. So this will all be indexed by the search engines. My favorite feature for One.IU is the individualized tasks. So in One.IU, I can go ahead and just search for sign up for classes, click on the task, and it'll take me straight to where I need to be to sign up for classes. The search and browse are, are really two distinct key ways of navigating the services that we uh, deliver in One. The most exciting th thing for me is where we go in the future in unifying our delivery of web-based services at Indiana University. My favorite feature and one of the best things I like about One is the search feature. Um, it makes the simplicity aspect a lot better, especially being a college student. One of the first things we do when we open the internet is go to Google. So it's nice just to have kind of a feature like that that we use all the time. Universities are highly distributed places where the people who run the cafe and food services in the residence halls or sell athletics tickets or manage the registrar or HR benefits, they've all got lots of different systems. And so one of the things that one.iu.edu does is it allows all of those people to publish their apps into our app store. So much like the ecosystem of Apple or Android grew, we're already seeing a huge acceleration of services published into one.iu. I think as we expand the use of one.iu.edu, the key thing is getting more services. So we are continuing to educate all the people who own apps and uh, services to get them published. We're increasingly tutoring people that now, just like an app store, their little service gets feedback. So now when they learn that, you know, they thought their approach to paying a parking ticket or, you know, looking up their grades was good and now the community feedback comes in and say, hey, that's a two-star experience, how do we correct that rapidly? We have never had that level of feedback to specific service owners and it is going to be transformative in the provision of services at Indiana University. People who've touched one.iu.edu, I think the core reaction is, my goodness, why hasn't it always been like this? 